Hi guys, welcome to Protocolus Point. Okay, so in this further tutorial, let's learn how to create a list view that can be reorderable by a user. For example, here I have created a demo app just as an intro of this tutorial. So you can see, I can just long press on any item and I can just drag it anywhere and I can keep it anywhere and reorder it. Okay, so this is the thing we are going to implement in this video tutorial. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so here I have created a new Flutter project in my Android Studio IDE and this is the code that is being given by Flutter team while creating new Flutter project and I have removed all the default code that is the counter code given by Flutter team. Okay, and for now I am just passing a empty container. Okay, so let's get started. So first of all I need to generate a list of items that should be shown in our list. Okay, so let's generate it. So I will make use of list for that. So final list which will be of type integer item list object name is equal to list dot generate and here I need to pass the length that I want to generate for this list. So I will just pass it as 16 something and I will just pass the index that has been generated. Okay, so I am just uh, generating a integer type list in this list view, list of array. Okay, and now I can use this to show in our list view. Okay, so let's do that. Okay, so I will just remove this empty container and instead of that, I will just make use of reorderable list view. Okay, so here there is a mandatory uh, properties that we need to use. So the first thing is a child. And the second one is a reorderable uh, function. Okay, so these are the two properties that we need. Okay, so here we, it will come our logic. Okay, and here inside I will just show the list of items by making use of list tell. Okay, so let's do that. So for that I will just make use of for statement to generate a list tell. So index 0 index is less than item list dot length and index plus plus. Okay, so just increment the index. And here I am going to create a list tell. List tell. And inside the list tell, I will just use a title. So inside title, I can make use of a text widget. Okay, so I will just name it as uh, item. Item list dot, uh, sorry, the index. Okay, and here we need to pass a key for this list tell, else the reorderable list will not work. Okay, so so we'll just pass the index of for this list tell. Okay, okay, so let me reload our app. Okay, so you can see we have our list view been generated. Okay, so now I can just move it but it is not working because here we need to apply our logic in this reorderable class or a property. Okay, so let's do it now. Okay, so here there are two parameters. One is old index and another is new index. So for example, I'm just holding the item for and I'm just dragging it, dragging it to a new position. So it was the old position over here and I'm just dragging it over here. So this is the new position. Okay. So we need to apply our logic over here. Okay. So let's do that. So for that I will just make use of state manager uh, state uh, set state to apply the changes. So if new index is greater than old index 
then new index will be minus 1 okay and then outside of this if statement final int temp is equal to item list of old index okay so here i am going to just store the item uh, data in this temp variable okay uh, now item list dot remove at position and here i will just pass our old index and then item list dot insert and here we need to pass two parameter one is the new index and one is the temp uh, data that is been generated that is our old index okay so this is the thing so this is our logic simple logic said so let's refresh our app and check if it is working or no okay so app is been restarted so we'll just hold on item 3 and we'll just drag it anywhere so you can see it is getting reordered so user can just make use of this feature